Back inside the spectrum, Louisiana Tech leading Utah State by a score of 35-22. It's football appreciation night here at the spectrum as the uh, WAC football champions That's signing autographs, displaying the WAC championship trophy, the famous Idaho Potato Bowl trophy as well. And Coach Wells now addressing the uh, fans here inside the spectrum. So we wanted to make sure you guys all saw it. Okay. Hey, just real quick, from the bottom of our hearts, from everybody on our staff, from everyone on this team, we want to say thank you to Aggie Nation, to the herd, to the group in America. Thank you very much. Okay, last thing I got for you is we got an exciting team coming back. You guys know it. We got some exciting recruits coming in. We're fired up to go in the Mountain West. Go get your season tickets right now. Thank you. <laughs> How about that? Coach Wells putting in a little plug for some season tickets. You got well yours? No, I don't have mine yet. <laughs> Better go get them. Got to go get them. Coach, going to the Mountain West Conference. Exciting recruits in the building. We heard Aggie football again. That's always good. Yeah, I, I know we had a recruit a couple weeks ago tweeted that he, that's one of the reasons why he chose Utah State when he came with the basketball game. Yeah, he, he heard Aggie football. That they heard Chan of that. Yeah, this place is, is getting loud. Hopefully they can take this momentum and shove it over to the basketball team and see if they can come out in the second half and play a little better. But Because right now they're struggling with the whack, let alone when they get into the Mountain West. How about whack standings and... Louisiana Tech, they were picked fourth in the conference preseason. They're in first, and they look like a first-place team to me here tonight against Utah State. And they're very aggressive. You know, other than uh, Gibson, you take away his 17 points, and they'd be struggling right now, Michael. I mean, he's come out, and he's been able to step up and knock down the shots. But UTSA, Seattle, Texas State, Idaho, those are teams that uh, La Tech went on the road and beat. Now, they had... Denver and New Mexico State at home. So we'll see how they play out after they go on the road to Las Cruces and to Denver because those are very good home teams. Any surprises that you saw on that list with the well, uh, I think standings? I think La Tech's big. I, I, yeah. think, I think that uh, I knew New Mexico State would be good. I knew Denver would be good. I thought Utah State would be a little better. But when you lose three of your best players, you know, you're going to have to just work with what you got. Okay, when we come back, we'll have stats and highlights in a moment. Lacek leading Utah State back after this.